February the 5th, 2018. Go Eagles fly, Eagles fly. Awesome game last night. Super Bowl was probably the best one I've seen in 10 years plus. Yep, I watched it. It was good. Nobody knelt. Pink did an awesome job on the national anthem. Got a voice that, man. All right, enough said on that. Let's get out here and find out what day it is. It is a national Nutella day, or Nutella day, Nutella. Yeah, you know, hazelnut and cocoa, you know, some other good stuff. A lot of people love it. Not part of mine, but that's all right. National Weather Person's Day. My favorite Janice Dean. My favorite Janice Dean. Yeah. Anyway. And then we have National Shower with a Friend Day. Ooh. No, Martin. Nobody wants to shower with you. Simple as that. That's why they send you out of your house so everybody else can shower. <laughs> Love you, Martin. Hey, we had a just stupendous time at the Super Bowl Herf for the Water Buffaloes last night. We'll talk about it in a bit. The best preparation. Yep. I got two quotes, really. The best preparation for tomorrow is to do today's work extremely well. And the other one is, when I count my blessings, I count you twice. Both of them are from unknown authors. But I tell you what, you can put Martin and Kippy and Matt and Sam and Zach in those, they're, they're stand up with me all the time. Anyway, count, count, I count my blessings, I count you twice. And the best preparation for tomorrow's, for tomorrow is to do your work extremely well today. Yeah. So think about it. Eagles did their work, got it done, beat the Patriots. You know, did my work done the day before, got a brisket, I don't know what happened, but out of a 14 pound brisket, we went <coughs> left over, and I have to go find one of the smaller ones and do some more, man, it was awesome, those guys just sucked it up. Normally we got four or five pounds of leftovers here and four or five pounds of leftovers there. Uh uh. Preparedness. We were ready. Ready for all contingents. Because I had done my work the day before. Because I had figured it out. Yes. That's how you do it. You take today as if it's going to be the last day on earth, the last hour on earth, and you do everything extremely well. You live for right now. Nothing else, no other time, right now. Get that puppy done. Get that thing done. Because you may not even get tomorrow. Anyway, hey, the water buffalo herf was awesome. I'll be posting a picture here shortly. We had an awesome turnout. All together we had 37 people. Go Water Buffaloes. And we have 62 cigars going to Cigars for Warriors. So you tell me. And that's with all the new guests and all the wives that don't smoke. They were inside watching a football game sucking down all the wine in the house. Who figured? Anyway, 
<sighs> we did have a very important person with us yesterday. Yes. Mr. Liam. You know who you are. You're my VIP boy. So much so that I pushed your dad out of the way just to give you a hug first. <laughs> hey, Kippy. You know where you rate. Anyway, out there, don't forget, today's cigar is a CAO. Yeah. But it's a special CAO. It's a flathead V554 camshaft. The wrapper is Connecticut Broadleaf. It is a Connecticut Habano binder. It is Nicaraguan long, long filler. It's made in Dominican Republic. It has a Maduro wrapper to it, and it's a medium full, about a 70 on the, on the scale from 0 to 100, mild to full, and it has a lot of pepper. Well, subtle pepper. It's not the overwhelming, but it's like a retro at the end. It's, oh, yeah. It'll make your body light up and enjoy. And with the three different kinds of uh, tobacco in there, you have even more enjoyment. It's one of them real good ones. So if you haven't tried it, get out there and try it. CAO Flathead V554 Camshaft. Awesome cigar. And remember... Smoke what you like, like what you smoke, and above all, kick some. <laughs>